On the grid, shade the region that satisfies all these inequalities. Label the region R. So the first thing we're going to want to do is draw each of these three lines onto this graph. Now in order to do this, we're going to want to change the inequality signs to equal signs. So this tells us that y will be equal to 1, x plus y will be equal to 5, and y will be equal to 2x. So if we first start off with y equals 1, and now the line where y will always be equal to 1 will look like this. Now the second equation, x plus y equals 5, what we can do is we can substitute some values into this. So when x is equal to 0, 0 plus y will be equal to 5. And therefore when x equals 0, y will be equal to 5. So we can mark this point onto our grid. And we can do the same for when y will be equal to 0. So when y equals 0, x plus 0 will be equal to 5. So again we can mark this point on the graph. So we now have two points, so we can draw a straight line between these two points. And we can use the same process for the line y equals 2x. So again we can choose two values to substitute into this equation. So if we start off with x equals 0, when x equals 0, y will be equal to 2 multiplied by 0. So y will be equal to 0. So next we can substitute x equals 2 into this equation. So when x equals 2, y equals 2 multiplied by 2. So therefore y equals 4. And again we can plot this point on our grid. And using a ruler we can join up these points. So we've drawn on all the lines we need to draw onto this grid. So now the final thing we need to do is work out which region is R. So the first inequality we've been given is Y is greater than 1. So the region in which Y is greater than 1 will be anywhere above the line Y equals 1. The second inequality, X plus Y, is less than 5. Well, if we choose the point 1, 3, then X plus Y will be equal to 4, and therefore X plus Y will be less than 5. So the region in which x plus y is less than 5 will be this region below here. Now the final inequality, y is greater than 2x. We can use the same process as before. So if we choose the point 1, 3, and we can substitute these values in, and this will give us 3 is greater than 2 multiplied by 1. So we can therefore work out that the region in which y is greater than 2x is this region over here. So because of this, the region which satisfies all of these inequalities is this region here. And we need to label this region, region R. Now this question's worth three marks. We'll get our first and second mark for correctly drawing in all three lines and we'll get our third mark for correctly shading in region R.